Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Jim Giraffe, back on the Symmetria server. Ooh. So, I have been gathering some materials. Sorry, look, look at that mess back there. Uh, <laughs> we'll just look this way. Gathering materials, breaking down some more trees, and I am ready to start on my base. So, I figure today we'll just start building and see where it takes us. So, let's jump in! So I am going to build the base in this open area right here. I might have to go back further. I'm not really sure how big it's going to be. I built out the front on a creative server, but that's it. So uh, I, I got some stuff to do. But anyways, I have these materials to start and let's just jump in. Well, I have some base progress for you right behind me. Unfortunately, I can't have my camera count, so there won't be a time lapse of this. But yeah, I I mean, it's it's basically just a front right now. <laughs> if you go to the sides, it's not done yet. Um, but I'm really liking how it's turning out so far. I'm still trying to figure out what I want and what levels. So I can kind of show you what I have so far, which is just bottom level. And then I made the staircase. And then up here is like an, an attic area, but I, I don't have a way up yet. Oops, I, I just fell. Um, yeah, so still working on it. I also just need a lot more own and what not for the sides and I also just haven't decided how I want to do the windows on the back so yeah just a lot of open-ended stuff right now but also now I want to build a wheat farm slash carrot farm um so I looked up a tutorial and I found a cool one so I'm gonna do that and it also uh, I don't have enough carrots but I, I can put wheat carrots and potatoes in it if I want I don't have any potatoes yet but yeah, so I'm gonna build that and it's pretty ugly. It's gonna be probably over here for now. I gotta clear out some trees and then I'll probably build something around it that matches like the this kind of theme feel vibe that this gives off. So yeah, I'm gonna start chopping down some trees and building and I'll check back in once it's done. So this is the wheat farm that I built. I don't have enough carrots yet to plant them in here, but once I have more, I'll probably do one level of wheat, one level of carrots. And this is super simple redstone just because I don't want to lag the server. So if I press this, it should work where water comes out of the dispensers and then it brings all the seeds down um, since there's no wheat right now. But I kind of just want to test it. So let's see if it works. Please work. Please work. Looks like it's working. Oh yeah. Oh, it missed one. Oh, what? that's so why Oh, did I miss water in the dispenser? I think I did. Okay, well, I'll fix that in a sec. Okay, and then I think if I repress it, they all get taken away. Oops. Ball. So you have to replant them, which sucks. I, it's, I don't want to do anything too complicated just because the server is so laggy. I don't want to make it worse, but maybe as people start like leaving, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, you know what? But my redstone didn't go far enough. I think I need another repeater. Also, I need to cut down these trees. I have a problem. Okay, so I have one repeater, so maybe I'll move it forward. There. Let's see if that will work. Basically, I just need to know if it gets this one. If it gets this one, then it's all working. I mean, this is basically like better than hand farming. Okay, cool. It was it was the redstone. Silly me. And all of the seeds should. Oh, let me turn the water off, and then all the seeds should appear. Yeah. And of course, when you get wheat, it'll end up there too. So, yeah. The most automated thing I can do that won't completely or any 
way add to the lag so I'm going to replant this now and I'll update when it's all grown and we'll see how much we get and I, I gotta chop down some of these trees so so I'll be back so I'm still waiting on all the wheat to grow in this, this this farm because you know it's it's a slow process don't have a lot of bone meal yet so that's that's not gonna happen but I figured I should kind of deal with my mess out here um, of, <laughs> of furnaces and chests and whatnot since I finally have a place where I can put them, sort of. So obviously, that is not done. But I do know where I want to put all the storage, which is up in my little attic. So I think first things first, I should finish filling in the roof. Maybe put in some rafters and then just use a lot of like barrels and chests and kind of variety because I think it'll look pretty cool and yeah I just I, I think it'll fit the theme well we'll see but I'm gonna start on that now I'm here again from my creepy window, which is all I've ever wanted in a house. A creepy window where I can just stare and watch anyone who dares to come by. Yeah. Anyways, I have been... Oh, sorry. <laughs> I just had an urge to throw a watermelon. I've been working, 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 so I'm just gonna kind of show you around what I've done so far. But first, I, like I said, I moved all my storage up to my attic. So obviously it's not like crazy. I don't have a lot of stuff yet, right? So I just wanted this to look like kind of a mess, but it's all it's all organized. Got our stuff all here. Obviously this isn't permanent, but I like this little area. It's I can stare at people creepily, which is you know what I've always wanted. I did some some logs up here and whatnot, and then. That's basically the only part of my vase that's actually enclosed because the rest, I I need to decorate. I need this, I think my bedroom will be on this level, but like it's not decorated. I have this staircase, but um, yeah, this is the whole first level. I don't even need to use the door right now, but it looks nice from the front. <laughs> I mean, hey, hey, no, no one's perfect. You know, masterpieces, they take time. So, also, I have been growing my carrots, so I have a lot more carrots, and all of my wheat growing has moved over here. And it's almost all fully grown, so I figured I would press the button and see how much I get just from this. So, let's try it out. Butter. Oh! How much? How much? Probably like a stack or two of wheat, I would assume. It'll take a minute for the hopper to collect it all, just because the server is a little laggy. There's this many people on, which, you know, actually is, isn't that many. <laughs> oh, okay, we'll wait. And then when I do get all the seeds out, I don't need them all, so I put them in there, compost them, and then I get bone meal out because I don't have anything to get bone meal right now. I've been trying to find a mine shaft or something so that I can get a spawner. And especially, I want cobwebs for decoration because I want everything to look old and gross. And well, I can't can't really do that without cobwebs, you know. And I don't know how to craft them. I don't think it's possible to craft them. So still on a hunt, which takes a lot of caving. Yeah. This is how much I got from that whole thing full. I think there was about three that weren't fully grown into wheat, so those just turned into seeds. And then with the seeds, I two stacks to replant and put the rest in here oops that's not that's not that's not a seed <laughs> all right and i'll replant the rest right i mean eventually i could make this more automated but because of the server lag right now it's a lot easier if i just do it by hand which i think i've already said 
I think next I'll build this with the carrots, but I have to grow enough carrots, which is what I've been doing with my hand farming, uh, because I do want villagers eventually, and to breed them, I need carrots. And I also need villagers. <laughs> which is a whole struggle. I've reached out to my neighbors on the server and left signs telling them if they have villagers, I will happily pay or breed them for them, but there's been no luck so far. Ah. All right, I'll replanted. So what I do need to figure out though is how I want to cover this up. Obviously I need to build some sort of building over this and I want it to be kind of creepy, run down looking, but I have no idea. It's such a weird shape. And obviously if I want to build a second one, then I can build a, or if, if I want to build a second one of these for the carrots, right? So I could have two weird shaped buildings. I don't know if you have any ideas of what I should build over this. Please comment it down below because I have no idea. I just, I just, I really don't know. <laughs> and eventually I also need to build something like a, a barn for them. Oh, also, I got a bird. He's my friend. Maybe I can get him to go on my shoulder. Will you come on my shoulder? Oh, yeah. This is my friend. What should I name him? I mean, I don't, I don't have name tags, but he's still my friend. I don't know what to call him. Hey, hey, where are you going? Where are you going, friend? Back on my shoulder, dude. Dude, dude. Okay. Come on, come on, you can do it. Can I get him? Can I get him? Hey, I got him. Oh, yeah. Well, I would say that's it for today's video. I'm gonna go do some more mining, get some more materials for, like, you know, the sides and the, and the insides of my house and hopefully find a spawner and cobwebs and there's just, there's just a lot to do but please leave any comments of what you think i should build over my wheat farm to make it fit the area and that is it i'll see you all next time okay bye